I am concerned about the F-35s coming here, and I would like to address it from a couple of points of view. The first one is what the 65 decibel level really means. When you hear 65 decibels and you compare it to other things like rock concerts and lawn mowers and snow blowers, it doesn't seem like it's that much noise. However, when you look a little bit closer into what 65 dB means in the DNL, in this designated area, it means an average of 65 decibels. So that's an average of 65 decibels, that level of noise, over a 24-hour a period of time and over a year. That's how it's measured. So to say that it's 65 decibels is really misleading because if someone, for instance, was going down the highway at 150 miles an hour, but you made an average over 24 hours and then over a year, that same amount of time would hardly be moving. I guess what I'm feeling is that we're not getting information that's straight up and, and straightforward. And I feel very disturbed about that, that it's not just obvious what the information is. Another thing that I feel like I would like to just mention is that I think there's more questions than answers. And I, I feel like that's the most disconcerting part of this whole thing, of why were we picked, because it's a highly designated area for population, and the Air Force says that shouldn't happen. Why aren't the other sites being released in comparison to Burlington when that information has been requested? And um, I guess if the answers were more honest and more forthcoming, and if I didn't feel like it was such a done deal, which is really heartbreaking that it might already be a done deal, I think that the dialogue would be a lot more honest. The one other thing that I want to say is that I have been such a loyal supporter of, of Bernie and Senator Leahy, and I certainly do appreciate um, our whole delegation as well as Governor Shumlin and but I feel that um, it's just heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking for me to feel that so many of the values that um, Bernie especially, and but all of them have espoused in terms of um, where money should be spent and not going towards the military and with these planes being drones that are offensive. They're not really defensive. They're not really going to defend us. That um, I just find it very um, sad and very heartbreaking that that there's not a, a better dialogue between us and our delegation and the people that represent us. And um, I would hope that that changes.